Hello and welcome to Men of the Den. My name's Eric and it's Friday. This week we're talking about our favorite YouTube channels. I've already done a video about this particular topic way back when. I'm going to put a link down to it in the crotch. Um, and not much of that has changed, but I will say that the frequency of my actually watching YouTube has changed quite a lot. I don't watch a lot of TV at all anymore. I spend most of my time reading news online and listening to podcasts more than anything. So I'm sorry, YouTube. <laughs> But I will say that there are two big channels that I still kind of focus on when I actually do go and watch uh, stuff online. Uh, the first one is CGP Grey. Uh, CGP Grey is a perennially fantastic educational channel, and uh, his work is outstandingly good. Uh, he's done explainer videos on a lot of different uh, complicated topics, and they're all very funny. They're all you know based on stick people and. Uh, they help bring down to a very uh, easy to understand level complicated topics like what is the difference between England, Great Britain, and the United Kingdom, you know, for instance. And uh, some of his most recent stuff has been about uh, power and political power, particularly. And uh, it's incredibly timely. <laughs> Uh, and uh, I would just strongly encourage you to go check that out. I'm going to put a link down to that down in the crotch. Um, so please check out CGP Grey. Um, and the other thing is that because of the fuckery of this election, I have just immersed myself in nothing but news. PBS NewsHour is still probably one of the most down-to-earth news reporting uh, programs uh, that's produced in America. Uh, it's produced by the Center for Public Broadcasting, sponsored by viewers like you, <laughs> and they make it freely available on YouTube for everyone. Uh, so, uh, you know, if if you're looking for very, you know, consistent, logical, non-dramatic news reporting, PBS NewsHour is definitely the place to go find that. I'll put a link to the NewsHour down in the crotch. I wanted to spend a little bit of time talking about where I get most of my information right now. Um, and I'm actually spending more of my entertainment time listening to podcasts. So I'm going to actually go through my podcast subscriptions just to tell you a little bit about um, what I have on here. Some of it's entertainment, some of it's news, some of it's books, <laughs> um, some of it's bullshit. <laughs> but uh, this is... I mean, this machine is in my ears uh, as I'm going to work, as I'm coming home. A lot of times while I'm at home, I'm listening to something while I'm online uh, doing something. Sometimes if I've got a minute to listen to something at work while I'm kind of plugging away at data entry, I'll be going through this. 99% uh, Invisible is a really cool podcast that uh, talks about design and architecture. Criminal, which is a fantastic series. If you like uh, stories like Serial, like if you got into Serial with Sarah Koenig, uh, Criminal is a really great one. It's like a half an hour show, and they go into uh, like little known, weird, <laughs> illegal things <laughs> or things that happen to people that are crimes. It's, it's just an absolutely fascinating show. Cthulhu and Friends. Cthulhu and Friends is uh, a real play podcast. Uh, uh, much like my friend Aram's God's Fall podcast, it is a, uh, this is a Call of Cthulhu, Cthulhu and Friends is a Call of Cthulhu RPG, uh, and it's on their fourth season now, I think they're wrapping up their fourth season, um, the storylines from beginning to end are just utterly batshit, and I love them. <laughs> All the people who play are really great actors, um, and, uh, not that they're famous actors, but they're very good at what they do. Um, they don't talk over each other very much. Uh, they, you know, really get into their roles, and <laughs> the dice rolls lead to some amazing complications. It's a, real, it's a lot of fun. Political stuff is, like, my new jam. So I'm listening to Decode DC, 538 Politics, uh, BBC World Service Global News Podcast... Rachel Maddow audio, <laughs> NPR politics on the media, 
uh, Slate's uh, Political Gab Fest, Trump Cast, the Ezra Klein Show, the New Yorker Political Podcast, the Run Up. Vox's The Weeds. I'm listening to a lot of political podcasts. I'm going to put all the links down in the bottom. Uh, <laughs> um, I listen to some movie podcasts. Uh, Linoleum Knife uh, is probably the best one that I listen to right now. Um, Dave White and Alonzo Duralde. Uh, Alonzo Duralde also on the Young Turk Networks on uh, What the Flick. Um, they are a gay, bare, married couple who review movies, and they're professional movie critics, professional film critics, and they are just a hoot to listen to. It's like basically them sitting at their kitchen table, like talking about movies, and it's just a lot of fun. Uh, um, Pseudopod, Pseudopod. Okay, if you like horror, like straight up horror, <laughs> Pseudopod is the show for you. Pseudopod is a kind of Lovecraftian-esque, like, horror fictional show, um, where they will read a story, uh, and the story often is, like, super disturbing. <laughs> Sometimes it's, like, flash fiction stories, where it's, like, you know, three, four, five little shorts. Um, but Pseudopod is, like, super creepy, and it's a lot of fun. The stories are really good. Um, sometimes they're classic stories, a lot of them are original, sometimes they're, uh, very, very new. Um, that they may even be original to the show, uh, some days. Um, but they are all very, very good. Um, The Read, The Read, <laughs> if you are looking for, like, the blackest, gayest show that you could listen to, The Read is definitely the best one. Um, Kid Fury and, uh, Crystal West, um, you may know Crystal West from Drunk History. Um, she's done the Marsha P. Johnson episode, which I mentioned before, uh, and she also did a Harriet Tubman episode. She is hilarious. Absolutely fucking hilarious. And Kid Fury is, like, the queeniest, wonder most wonderful person, um, and they just talk about, like, black life and black issues, and they are totally fucking awesome. You totally listen to the read. Um, but yeah, so I listen to podcasts, and I probably spend hours and hours and hours listening to podcasts these days. Um, I, you know, <laughs> sorry YouTube, <laughs> I found a new mistress. So, uh, that's my video. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to our channel. You can find us on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, and Instagram, and I will see you next Friday. Cheers!